friends welcome to my channel let us discuss how to draw projections of a straight line projection means image or drawing okay projections we are taking front view of the line top view of the line like that where we are doing the drawing in engineering drawing we are taking the planes horizontal plane and vertical plane in these planes we are doing the drawing of the straight line okay in it take the first condition line is parallel to both hp and vp here i will show one example so i am taking this is the line why I am calling this is a line means it has some length. Okay, it has two ends. So we can call it as line. Okay. And then take this is a horizontal plane and this is a vertical plane. I am keeping right angle to each other. Okay, it may be first coordinate. This is a HV and this is the vertical plane. Now I am taking one straight line, keeping the line like this. Okay. So this line is at some distance from horizontal plane at some distance from vertical plane okay is this line is parallel to horizontal plane yes it is parallel to horizontal plane okay is this line is parallel to vertical plane yes this line is parallel to vertical plane we can call it as this line is parallel to hp and parallel to vp so we can call it as this line is parallel to both hp and vp correct so here we are taking the same condition line is parallel to both hp and vp okay so this condition we are taking like this for doing the projections of this straight line okay in this condition i took one question here take the question here a 50 mm long line okay length of the line is 5 cm and what is the name of this line line pq okay is parallel to both the hp and vp so 5 cm line is parallel to both hp and vp so we can take the example as i told this is hp this is vp this line is parallel this line is pq line okay this is parallel to both the planes okay take the next data this pq line is 25 mm in front of vp vp means vertical plane and 60 mm above the hp okay so take the first one 25 mm in front of VP. So we can take this one is this distance is okay. If you are taking this is 25 mm in front of VP and this distance is 60 mm above HP. Okay, whatever from horizontal plane, this gap is 60 mm. As we know in this example, we are taking the 5 centimeter line. This is the PQ line of 5 centimeter. And what we have to find? Draw its projections. Projections means as I told, we have to draw the drawing or images of this line. What type of images we can do? Here, projections means we are taking front view of that line and top view of that line. So this is the PQ line. That's why we are giving the name for front view P dash Q dash with small letters and with dash. And for top view we are giving PQ, small PQ. Okay. So here I am keeping the line like this. Okay. And here if you see the front view, front of this object, front of this line, we can see the image on the vertical plane. It is called front view. Top view means if you see from top, we can see the image of this line, okay, on the horizontal plane. It is called top view, okay. If you see from front, okay, so whatever line length is there, it is 5 centimeter. We can do the parallel line here, 5 centimeter line with P dash, Q dash. And how much distance from the XY line? This is the XY line. XY means which is joining both horizontal plane and vertical plane, okay. From this line, this is already given 60 mm above HP. Okay, this gap is 60 mm. Okay, above 60 mm, we can see this line on the vertical plane. Okay, here I will do from distance, we can take this some 6 centimeters. So, from it, 6 centimeters from this line, we can take one point. Here we can see the line. How much line? Take 5 centimeter line. Here, take line length is 5 centimeter. And this is the line, it is a front view. Okay, if we keep the line, we can see the image here. Okay, what is the name we are giving for front view? P dash Q dash. I am marking it is P dash, it is Q dash. So, after doing the front view, okay, here we need to do the next image that is top view. Okay, if you see from top of this, we can see the entire line. Okay, on the horizontal plane. Okay, whatever length of the line, we can see the entire length here also. Okay, in the top view, we can see this gap also. Okay, this gap is 25 mm. So, here we can see the line of 5 cm. So, just I will do the line here. 
of 5 centimeter. Here remember one thing, here P dash I took, so P will come on the same projector line, okay, because we are taking the common line, this is P point, so P dash and P will come on the same line, just do here, let us take one line here, so here we can see this entire line on this horizontal plane, this gap is 25 mm, okay, so this gap we can see from this XY line, okay, so just keep that gap 25 mm. And do here 5 centimeter line. So, this is the top view of this line. Okay. So, I am marking small p, small q. Always remember p dash and p should come on the same line. It is called projector line. And q dash and q should come on the same line. Because line length is same in the front view as well as in the top view. Now, here this is the front view p dash q dash. And this is the top view p q. So, here this is a 3d diagram okay in engineering drawing so every time we can't do in right angle triangle it is taking lot of time let's assume our line is in the first quadrant so as we know this is the vertical plane this is the horizontal plane these two lines making this area into four quadrants first second third fourth our line is in the first quadrant for shifting this 3d into 2d what we are doing we are tilting this horizontal plane in clockwise direction okay we are just tilting it in the downward direction so this is a single plane if it is coming in this direction this will move in upper direction okay this part is coincide with this part after coming here this part will coincide with this part okay so for us we are taking the line in first quadrant so here what i am take, taking this is horizontal plane i am shifting in downward direction i am tilting in downward so like this okay clockwise like this after that we are getting the images like this this is the after tilting means we are converting 3d into 2d after Converting into 2D, we are getting the images of the line like this. P dash, Q dash and PQ. And this gap is 6 centimeters. This gap is 2.5 centimeters. Okay, we need to do these projections on the sheet. Let us do it. First, we need to do at the middle XY line. Okay, this is the XY line which is joining vertical plane and horizontal plane. Take the XY line of any length. Okay, length is, we can take at uh, 10 centimeter, 12 centimeter like that. Okay, like this. And after that, Mark this line, draw this line P dash Q dash which is 6 centimeters from this XY line. Okay. So from this line, 6 centimeter distance. So already I have marked one point here, 6 centimeters. For doing the parallel lines, I am using this scale, roller scale. So till the scale up to this point, this point, just do the 5 centimeter line. Just do one line. On it mark 5 centimeters okay this line is the front view i am marking p dash q dash okay and then after doing this line do this line pq line at 2.5 centimeter from xy mark one point so 2.5 centimeter just do the projector lines so here we did this line now we have to do this line at 2.5 centimeter from the xy so here as we know p dash and p are coming on the same line and q dash and q are coming on the same line okay it is called projector lines okay projector so you just do the projector here i will do one projector line in light color at q dash also at q dash also do the projector line after doing these lines here at 2.5 centimeter do this line so from it XY line at 2.5 centimeter do the line so here at this point do the line the name of this line is called top view so we have to give PQ small letters okay so this is a front view this is a top view so like that we can do the projections of the given line of 5 centimeter this line is parallel to both HP and VP after doing the projections Mark the given dimension, this is 60, this is 25 and line length is 50. So in next class, we will see what are the projections of different positions of the given lines. Thank you for watching.